Princess Diana became Lady Diana Spencer after her father inherited the title of Earl Spencer in 1975. She married the heir to the British throne, Prince Charles, on the 29th of July, 1981. They had two sons and later divorced in 1996. Diana died on the 31st of August, 1997, from injuries she sustained in a car crash in Paris. She is remembered as the People's Princess because of her widespread popularity and global humanitarian efforts. Diana was born on the 1st of July, 1961, near Sandringham, England. Diana was the daughter of Edward John Spencer, Viscount Altrup, and Frances Ruth Burke Roche, Viscountess Altrup later known as the Honorable Frances Chantide. Her parents divorced when Diana was young, and her father won custody of the children. Diana had two older sisters, Lady Jane Fellows and Lady Sarah McCorkwoodale, and a younger brother, Charles Spencer, 9th Earl Spencer. Following her initial education at home, Diana attended Riddlesworth Hall School and then West Heath School. Although she was known for her shyness while growing up, she showed an interest in music and dancing. On the 6th of February, 1981, Prince Charles proposed to Diana with an 18-carat white gold ring topped with a 12-carat oval salon sapphire surrounded by 14 solitaire diamonds. It was made by the crown jeweler Gerard and reportedly inspired by a brooch created in 1844 Prince Albert as a wedding present for Queen Victoria. The ring reportedly cost Charles £28,000 at the time. Diana Spencer became Diana, Princess of Wales, when she married Charles on 29 July, 1981. Their wedding took place at St. Paul's Cathedral in the presence of 2,650 guests. After the couple's fairy tale wedding, Diana felt overwhelmed by her royal duties and the intense media coverage of nearly every aspect of her life. She began to develop and pursue her own interests. She served as a strong supporter of men at charities and worked to help the homeless, people living with HIV and AIDS and children in need. Diana and Charles had two sons together, Prince William Arthur Philip Louis, born on 21 June, 1982, and Prince Henry Charles Albert David, known widely as Prince Harry, born on 15 September, 1984. The couple became estranged over the years, and Diana struggled with depression and bulimia. During their union, there were reports of infidelities from both parties. According to the Diana Chronicles, a book by Tina Brown, Diana had fallen head over heels for Hasnat Khan, a Pakistani heart surgeon whom she met in 1995. Queen Elizabeth II urged Diana and Charles to officially end their marriage. Diana retained her title of Princess of Wales and her apartments at Kensington Palace, but she agreed gave up the title Her Royal Highness and any claim to the British throne. Diana's separation from Charles was announced in December 1992 by British Prime Minister John Major, who read a statement from the royal family to the House of Commons. Their divorce was finalized in August 1996. Following her divorce, Diana devoted herself to her sons and charitable efforts, including raising awareness about the dangers of leftover landmines in war-torn Angola. She maintained a high level of popularity with the public. I think Mrs. Parker Bowles was a factor in the breakdown of your marriage. Well, there were three of us in this marriage, so it was a bit crowded. Diana whipped the British tabloids into a frenzy when she began dating Egyptian film producer and playboy Dodie Fade in 1997. Early in the morning of 31 August, 1997, they both were trying to escape from the paparazzi. Normal programming has been suspended, and we now join Martin Lewis in the news studio. This is BBC Television from London. Diana, Princess of Wales, has died after a car crash in Paris. The French government announced her death just before five o'clock this morning. Buckingham Palace confirmed the news shortly afterwards. Normal programs have been suspended while we bring you the latest developments throughout the morning.
While visiting Paris, Diana and Dodi Fade were involved in a car crash after trying to escape from the paparazzi early in the morning of 31 August, 1997. Fade and the driver were pronounced dead at the scene. Diana initially survived the crash but succumbed to her injuries at a Paris hospital a few hours later. She was 36 years old. News of her sudden, senseless death shocked the world. Queen Elizabeth II, who was criticized for not immediately responding publicly to Diana's death, made a televised address from Buckingham Palace on 5 September, in which she said, no one who knew Diana will ever forget her. Millions of others who never met her, but felt they knew her, will remember her. I, for one, believe there are lessons to be drawn from her life and from the extraordinary and moving reaction to her death. I share in your determination to cherish her memory. Following an investigation into Diana's fatal car accident, a report released in 1999 determined that the driver was at fault for driving at a high speed while under the influence of alcohol and antidepressant drugs. Charges were dropped against several photographers who were initially blamed for causing the crash. <laughs>